Hello besties, welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are well. Welcome to a pack with me for my summer holiday. Honestly, one of my top tier videos to film. Partly because I love styling, partly because I love organisation and partly because I just love sharing every little bit of my life with you guys. So I'm going to Turkey literally, what's the time? I don't even know, less than 24 hours and I have not packed a single thing my room is full of clothes that need organizing i need to decide what i want from last year out of the new stuff i've brought what i want to take i literally have got no outfit styled i've got a lot of clothes but no outfit so i'm going to turkey for a week with my family i'm so so excited i feel so blessed to be going and basically your girl just needs to pack so i thought we could pack together my suitcase is full currently my bed is full currently and i feel like i just need to get on top of my game so I've got a cup of tea. I also just finished my prep with me, so you guys can also see like how I've prepped like maintenance and beauty and all of that. So I've made myself a cup of tea, Primark by the way, and it is good vibes today. We are feeling excited. So essentially I need to pack everything. I also want to make a trip to Primark this afternoon because I have not got like any new jewellery bits and I feel like I just need to stock up on belly chains and so maybe some new pairs of sunglasses, some bracelets, some rings, you know, just the things that really accessorise your outfits, like some claw clips, things like that, maybe some headbands, I don't know. So I need to make a trip to Primark. I also have a parcel at the post office, apparently a Zara top that I ordered that hasn't arrived, which I need to collect. I also need to maybe go to B&M. I need a new tripod for my camera so I can get like the best content out there. So we're busy bees this afternoon and this evening and probably going into the morning. So we need to style all my outfits, we need to pack them, we need to try them on. I'll show you guys what I've been purchasing. I also need to get all my toiletries in order. I need to get my little suitcase out the loft. So it's giving busy, it's giving unprepared. I do feel though, no matter how prepared you can be for a holiday, the day before or the day of, like depending on your flight, you're always going to be rushing around. I wish I was better. Maybe in 10 years time, I'll have learnt. But right now, the 22 year old version of Jodie is stressed. So I thought we could spend the time together getting it all ready. I know you guys like these videos and honestly, they're one of my favourites to film. So we've got a cup of tea. I think first step is going to be going through all the clothes on my bed and just like deciding what I think I want to take and then I think we'll try on, we'll style. I'll show you guys my little like styling hacks that I always do when I go on a trip because I hate to get on a trip and be like, oh, I don't know what to wear this dress with. No, 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 no. The past Jodie in England has already sorted that out for the turkey, turkey Jodie. So let's get into it. I hope you guys are excited. Grab yourself a cup of tea. It's probably going to be a long one. And yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait to go on holiday tomorrow. I can't believe it. Okay, so we've got Boohoo bits. We've got New Look bits. We've got Primark bits. These are some bits that I had from holiday last year in this H&M beach bag. I've got a Primark beach bag full of clothes. I've got Sheen haul. I've got Zara bits. I have got, this is the state of my case, which is just sickening. But I'll show you guys my case properly. Oh, wrong way. But I have this It luggage case. Honestly, so worth the money. My brother's used it and he said that the wheels broke but it's not really the wheel it's just this it's just got a little crack but it'll be fine it'll definitely get me through the trip so yes let's sort through this decide what we want okay these are mainly boohoo dresses and like cover-ups that i've brought uh, this year and then these are shorts that i've brought like little beach shorts i think that's a beach cohort these trousers i love from plt i wore them last year when i went to ibiza and we went on a boat trip to formentero and it's the day that i found out i got a first in my uni degree and honestly i feel like these trousers i will never be able to throw away because they just remind me of that so i love these but they are quite thick they're like a knitted and i feel like for turkey they might just be too warm i don't know ibiza obviously isn't as warm as turkey like turkey we're talking 40 plus degrees i be feels more like 30 so i don't know if they'll be too warm but okay then we've got more bikinis we have also got oh these are matching shorts to that shirt more shorts i think that's a cover up and then these are boohoo bikinis i think i bought and a little cover up this is so cute okay i feel like what i might do is try and make a pile of things that i know like i will definitely take probably things that i've already tried on i know how they fit and i definitely want so, for example, the Boohoo Co-Ward, I literally brought specific... Is that annoying? It's just, it's quite hot today. I definitely want to wear this because I um, brought it for the trip. So, I think I might just do that. So, let's do that. Then I'll come back. I'll try everything on. 
we'll style them up. I basically need like seven to, I'm gonna, we'll go there for seven days, but obviously I'm gonna be wanna, want to be taking like content for Instagram and stuff. So I'm probably gonna take like 10 outfits for the day. Then that gives us a bit of wiggle room, probably the same for the evening, just so that I can get like as much cute content while I'm out there. Cause I feel like it, a holiday is literally a content creator's dream. <laughs> Okay, may not look like I've made progress, but I actually have. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I've got 11 potential evening eight bits laid out on the floor, which obviously we need to try and decide which ones we actually like. But we've got all, all of those there. We've got all of my, all that is stuff that I don't want to take. All of this here are beach cover-ups. And I've also got some shirts here. And then also I've got my shorts here which i need to go for i've also got these really cute cords that i got a couple years back from zara they're like little knitted shorts with a little bralette but i wore them in mallorca and i really liked it but they're a little bit short i think they're better for like a breakfast you know like if you wearing it as an ape fit in the morning i feel like at night it's a little bit i don't know and then i've got the same sort of vibe but this mustard color but this one's really cute it's a little bit of a thicker top and then the shorts are like this but i thought even if i just like mix and match them maybe with like a big white shirt or even just to travel home and i obviously need to travel home outfit too so i'm potentially going to take the mustard one for that all my shorts there then my bikinis i've got 13 laid out that i really like haven't tried um all of them on yet so i need to try some of the sheen ones on but yeah i'll show you them so we've got look at all the color it looks so fun so we've got some that i've had in past years like i brought that last year it's just a plt one but it's really comfy and just simple we've got some boohoo ones about we've got a boohoo swimsuit and then the rest of these are all actually sheen so i need to try them on style them with some of my beach cover-ups decide what i actually like 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 i said all my shorts are here and i've also got this lovely knitted cord from primark a few years ago actually and then here are my evening outfits that i've just threw on the floor to try on okay so first little daytime outfit i'm thinking i've got this really cute bikini from sheen and i got this big like peach shirt a few years ago it definitely needs an iron because it's been scrunched up but i thought it sort of goes with the colors but i don't know if it's just a bit off but i did think i could maybe do the white towel shorts these are miss path a while ago but I could maybe do like something like this and then this shirt i mean it's not the best but at least it's like colorful and i could always like maybe tuck in something like this i don't know whether it looks weird or i could probably pull this off i don't know but beach bag beach bag that i brought for this year is this really gorgeous one from boohoo it's like a knitted oversized it gave me ganny however you say that vibes so this will be the beach bag that i take i got this one from h&m last year which i love but i said my mom could use it this year um because i brought this one so i mean i could steal it back off her but yeah i'm not sure about the shirt i mean at least it's colorful I feel like just thrown on and then my shoes i'll deal with later but probably just some like yeezy sliders i've got flip-flops from primark but i realize i feel like with holiday you just gotta go colorful and then obviously without the shirt i feel like this is just such an easy look nice to go to the pool i have got a big white shirt which might look better i was just thinking add peach i do need my mom to buy my shirt so she said to me the other day i'm the worst ironer that's one thing that i'm not good at ironing my mom was like do you want me to iron anything and i was like what clothes am i going to be taking on holiday that need ironing it was period week and i was like don't be so ridiculous and she was like okay then don't worry about it but here i am all my scrunkled up short and um, shirts i mean white is cute i could do with a more of a pink i don't know where i have a pink at ollie's mom's because i used to keep a lot of my this looks cuter doesn't it i think just white and then maybe accessorize with got a few bandanas and we've also got a few hats i mean this hat is one that i got from h&m which is really cute i'll probably just pack it even if i don't it is cute actually this it's got pink and blue even if i don't like properly style it with anything i'll probably just take this just to wear 
not this. I mean, my hair's not really. I wish I would have got one of these in pink now. But this, again, super easy to style. But I have got these bandanas. Obviously, if my hair was down, could I do like a, you know, a, I don't know. I mean, it's not really giving the vibe, is it? Because my hair, but you guys get the gist. We could do a little bandana moment. And then actually, which would be cute, I've got these like big puffy sliders from, I don't know whether I'd have got these when I worked for Hidden. I feel like these are giving that sort of energy. But they're just like a big like marshmallow. I'm trying not to step on my evening outfits. Shoe. Okay, I really like this actually. Still torn between the shirts. I think the white's the safe option. The the peach is like a maybe. But I have also got, look at me. I've also got a blue shirt, which would that be funner? Oh, I feel like this, I feel like we've, have we cracked it? I don't know. But then I feel like I need a blue sh blue short. Hmm. I love this shirt though. This is from a brand on ASOS, what's it called? This is from, oh, made in Turkey. Oh, this is from a brand called As You. It's got it on the back. Hmm, what do I prefer? I'll know when I edit it back, which I prefer. I feel like I'd probably throw either the white or the peach. I like this, but it's a bit too much, so I haven't got any other, thing, any other things blue to sort of pull it back. So, yeah, this is outfit one for sure. These shorts. I've also got... These shorts from Zara, which are really nice, a little black pair. These are Boohoo, and they've got the matching shirt, which I'll probably wear with like a more of a neutral, plain bikini. And then I've also got these really cute ones from Zara, which, no, it's a bit much, isn't it? These are really cute. I got these a few, maybe last year, the year before. Um, so yeah, this is outfit one. What I do is basically, if you've never watched the pack with me, I will put all my outfits out and then once I'm like happy with them, I normally take it to the extreme with like sunglasses, but to be honest, I just feel too unorganized and I don't even know where my sunglasses are. So things like that, I'll decide just on the day as and when, but I just wear a big like oversized turtoise shell sunglass with this. So let's quickly get through the um, bikinis as this will be a long video. <laughs> okay, second bikini is this like toweling one. If you watch the Sheen haul, it's got like pretty, um, flowers in towel and it's got this little butterfly here so this one's really cute i throw it on with these shorts not super obsessed other option would either be this pink cover-up from boohoo which i love i feel like i'll wear this just a lot because it's just so easy to throw on or i have also got this one from boohoo this is much more of like a girly vibe Maybe like this would be cute. Maybe like have the butterfly poking out somehow. I like this. I feel like this dress again will just be something to easily reach for, throw on. Or I'll show you how the other knitted one looks. I can't remember what boohoo bits I've tried on for you and what I haven't. So, or the other option would be, I'm stuck, would be this. I really like I don't think the pinks really go though because this is much more of like a purpley pink I feel like it needs to be something a little different under here I'm not sure what I don't know whether this would be better paired with this bikini from Boohoo because it's got that same colour I feel like I need to probably get away from the pressure of having like fully styled outfits purely because like we're just going to like all-inclusive turkey we're not going to ibiza and going to like beach clubs like the bikini's cute i feel confident in it i don't really need to style it head to toe i feel like i'd throw on whatever i fancied on that day over the top so love this the tea how this tea's still warm i don't know it's as if it's been in a like a flask i truly feel like these were meant to be worn together this is a swimsuit from boohoo and then these are some like linen i keep thinking they've got pockets these are some trousers from 
Primark. They're like a linen paper bag waist. They're so nice. I think we're going to probably go on a boat trip while we're over there. And I feel like these, like this is the perfect sort of eight fit two wear. And then I'd probably just take this bag, throw in a pair of sunnies. Where are my PLT sunnies? I feel like they. These are my go-to PLT sunnies. I love them. I thought this is probably what I would wear. And then just some cream sliders. And then to be fair on the boat trip, I'd just take a bikini with me to throw on, like if I was going in the water. But I really love this swimsuit. I think it's so flattering. It's got like a nice cheeky bum. I bought it to a spa um, and I like it. So yeah, this is definitely an outfit I'm taking. Okay, this outfit is a moment. These are Primark trousers, again, um, like a sheer light wide leg and then this is a bikini from boohoo i love it just got these sunnies on again from plt i feel like i need to get a lighter pair of sunnies though or maybe like a pink pair might have a look in h&m late like, when we go to primark but i love this bikini i feel like the key to feeling confident in swimmer is just find like shapes that make you feel good and like make your body look good like i really like a nice lift because i don't have much boob but then i also really like a triangle and like putting them upside down and things but i thought this was a really cute outfit again i would maybe throw on the white shirt sometimes in like the restaurants like for breakfast you have to sort of cover up uh, it depends how like i think if we've been to hotels in turkey that make you and then hotels that also don't but it also looks really nice with like a white shirt. How nice would a bright pink beach bag look? Unnecessary though, completely. I do have this bandana, which it might be a bit too much, but it might also go. It might go. I could do like a, I don't know. I wish I had more hair to pull down. I don't have managed that to be fair. Normally I have no bits. But yeah, this again is definitely going to be an outfit. I feel bright, cute. How many is that now? One, two, three, four. Three more and then a few extras. But one I really want to wear is I really do love these trousers. But I'm thinking I could do a really cute cream and green moment. So I got this bandana from Primark last year. If it was a little bit darker, it looked really nice. I've got literally this pattern but in like a bottle green bikini from Sheen. I thought, how lovely would this be with this bikini from PLT and the bag? I thought this is gorgeous and I could actually style it up really nicely with these shorts from Primark. I've never seen anyone else have these shorts and I never saw them again. I remember I just came across them, I think maybe in the four like so random and i was like oh, i have to get this so i think that could be an outfit and i was thinking the trousers but they are different greens so yeah i feel like these just are probably going to be a no which is such a shame but i mean they've had the moment formentero was such a moment kind of looks like i'm a granny trying to blend into rubber bank but imagine the hair down right the top also just needs a little bit of work to be a little bit tighter but how cute is this outfit i really like the cream on cream on cream energy i also thought that this bikini would look really nice you know with my h&m linen trousers but i thought it's nice to have like a full cream moment but what i'd probably i would probably wear this outfit with the the bandana is a good idea, but I just don't know if I'll have the bottle to actually wear it. I don't know. Whereas this hat, minus the claw clip getting in the way. How nice is this? Cream on cream on cream on cream on cream. I feel like this bikini can be styled with literally anything. I could also wear it with this. One sec. Um, this the right way. This is from Boohoo to you guys. And they have it in a few colours. I think... Did me want the green? The only thing that I would say about this dress is it comes up a little short, but you can retie the bows, and I think that would add the length that it needs. I feel like this is cute if you wanted more of just like a monochrome moment. And what would look really cute is this hat that I got from Sheen. Again, it's not going to fit on my head, but imagine how nice is that. Okay, next bikini I'm going to pack is this one from Sheen. It's got like lots, lots of fruit on it. It's got these like blueberries and 
what look like green bananas and ice cream and watermelon and everything and i've got watermelon on my nails which i love i thought this would be a really cute bikini to go with the as you shirt and the zara shorts i've worn an outfit i think i wore this in ib for last year but obviously with a different bikini um, I thought this is just really cute, easy to throw on, and you can just like go between the shirt and the shorts like throughout the day, obviously depending on what you're up to. So love this. Okay, I think I'm just gonna take this as a daytime outfit. I don't quite know what bikini will look good under it. I don't know if it'll have to be neutral. I feel like the patterns on the bikini is just sort of poking through a bit too much on the top to look cute but I mean it's got to be practical so I'm just going to take it because it's so cute it might look cute with this under but I don't know I just feel like this is just like a perfect going to breakfast maybe going into the town to get like an ice cream or I don't know maybe like whatever I don't know but I just thought this is too cute to not take don't quite know but I'm going to definitely pack this I just love it they also do this in black I feel like drinking a cup of tea in a bikini will never feel right but love this so much from boohoo boohoo's honestly such a go-to especially for holiday clothes i feel like their quality is always so good i love their like colors and this bikini from sheen has actually got a little bit of blue in which i feel like goes really nice and then i also have this one from sheen like what is really the difference this is yellow but what i do have which I thought was cute. We could actually go for like a yellow. <laughs> Sometimes I edit these videos back and I think, Jodie, what's wrong with you? But I'm thinking I could do this yellow and then this could just be the day where I steal the yellow bag back off my mum and do like a yellow moment. Maybe with like the white shirt, but I do also have these yellow shorts. So I could do like a full like ray of sunshine moment. But honestly, love this so much. Super easy. I feel like these cover-ups are just the easiest to wear because, like, you're covered. You look cool. Like, oh, what a lovely crochet beach cover-up. But you haven't actually had to think about it at all. So, love that. So, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. This is seven. I thought I might have whittled them down a little bit. I mean, let's keep going and then we can always hold a few back that we don't need because I hate overpacking. I do just think it's such a waste. Okay, that was a lot, but we've got to the end of all the swimwear and all like the day outfits. I've just put some like dresses um, and like short combos. I'll just run through them in a minute, but I've just put those in a pile. I've done all my swimwear and I'm gonna show you my little like hack, which I can't tell you guys to do more. So what you're gonna do is lay out the outfit as you've styled it, you've tried it on, you know how it looks, you know you're happy with it. You're gonna lay it out in a flat lay like this. Then you're gonna grab your phone, you're gonna go onto camera, and you are gonna take a picture. And then, if you can see, I've just done it for all my outfits so far that I've styled. And then I can just put these in a folder and then all my outfits, I already know what I wanna wear. I started doing this a few years ago and it just made the process of being on holiday and like getting ready so much easier because in the morning i can just think right what do i want to wear and i can just flick through and think oh okay i want to wear this and then you know you need to get this bikini these shorts you know just like how you've styled it and how you actually want to wear it because there's nothing worse than like wearing something and thinking oh i should have worn the hat with it or i should have i don't know depends on how much you guys care but obviously it's a big thing to me like i love it it's actually like my biggest passion like fashion and styling so that's personally what i like to do so what i've done with all my bikinis is this is why i keep all my sheen bags so exactly how i styled them i've took the picture and then i've just rolled them up other than hats because i don't want my hats to get squashed but like flimsy crochet dresses and shorts i've done it so i've got two in here i've got two in here same in here and then the cherry one is just in here. I obviously need to cut the top, but I thought I'll just put it in there for now. So those are all over there. And then in this one, I've just put like bikinis that I think I might just take purely for like content. So I've just got a few extras in there. Um, and then I've got this one. So, so I'm just going to fold this up. Also, I found these really cute phone charms that I forgot I had. I thought they were 
I thought they were belly charms to start, belly chains, but they're actually phone charms. But I thought, how cute, I forgot I had these. So I'm just putting them in a little pile. And then I'm just going to grab the bag. Put this in the bag. And then zip it up. So for daytime outfits, what I'm going to take, other than like what I've already packed away... I haven't put my shirts in because I need to just... The blue one's fine, but this one really does need ironing. But then I don't know whether to take the travel iron because this surely is just going to get creased in my case. I don't know. But I've got my shirt here. Then I've got the black crochet dress. No, the black cover-up from Boohoo. I've also got this ditzy floral one, a um, little like mini dress from Boohoo. I've also got this crochet set from Boohoo. And then the Zara cardboard. I'm going to take the mustard one. So I'm going to put all of these in a pile and they're going to be my day outfits. But on to evening outfits. So what we have got, I'm not going to try all these on because I have tried a lot of it already on. Whether it's been on TikTok, in hauls, like I've tried a lot of these bits on. But I need to decide what I want to wear with this skirt. If you followed the journey along for this skirt honestly this better be the best outfit i've ever worn on holiday so this is the product code i don't know if they still sell it because it was in the sale um i noticed okay we're going to focus this is the product code if you guys are interested so it's this skirt so to start with i was thinking i don't know if to it with black or white but i actually like the idea of either styling it with pink or orange and i actually have this stradivarius top in orange and i thought it would really pull the orange out the only thing is i don't have like cute orange slides i think i'd have to do black slides and then i have got an orange bag so i don't know if to do this so i'll try this one on but i thought how gorgeous is that instead of just doing up black and white and being a little bit more boring i don't know maybe it won't work i've also got this midi knitted striped dress which i thought would be gorgeous it's like an aqua and white so i'm definitely going to pack that then also this denim dress which i thought was just like a fun moment this is from boohoo that's from boohoo too um i thought this would be a fun moment it just sips up the back probably wear this towards the start of the holiday like when i'm not super tanned maybe just like a chilled night at the hotel this is so many of my clothes. I would say majority of my holiday stuff this year I've either got from Boohoo, Sheen, and I've got little odd bits from Zara. Um, but yeah, mainly I've brought from Boohoo, to be fair. So I've got these pinstripe trousers, which I brought originally for the beach, but I styled it with this corset, and it looked so cute. So I think this will actually be one of my evening outfits. It's like a blue and white mesh um corset and it like twists over i can't hold it up can you see how gorgeous is that so that's going to be one of my outfits so that is one two three four then i've got this sheen top just a little basic but i thought it'd go really nice with this skirt from sheen so that with just some cream sliders i'm just going to grab my shoes like as and when at the end if I know what I want to wear them with. Then I've got these two dresses from Sheen again. House of Sunny Dupe, so cute. And then this olive green. They're like a halter net backless um, moment. And with the olive green, I want to do like a scrape back bun. I saw this gorgeous picture on Pinterest and I just want to recreate that picture. So I'm thinking like scrape back bun, big Primark hoops, which I think are in my jewellery box down here. And then also this, which is stunning. It's a little cardboard. It's a little like floral cardboard, it's hook and eye, it's from Boohoo. And then this is the matching skirt. It's got a little slit at the front, which I thought would be gorgeous. I did also get... Um, what was I going to say? Also got some other bits from Boohoo, but they just don't... They don't really fit. Like I got this really lovely yellow midi skirt knitted, but it's so see-through and I just don't and it's too big so i just thought what is the literal point this is so cute it's a cardboard from sheen it's like ditzy floral and it's got this top okay see you in a bit and i realized that you tie these two like in a bow at the front when i was editing back i thought jody you're an idiot um so i've got that cardboard there and then I've also got these trousers from New Look. And I thought these would look really lovely with either a white or a black. But I'm thinking white because apparently at the hotel once a week there's like a white night. So mum was like, oh, you've got like 
got to find like a white outfit and I was thinking I don't know if I have one um, but I thought this would actually go really lovely with a little white top. These are just, this is the same even as the orange one, Stradivarius. I cannot tell you guys to get these enough. If they still sell them, I'll try and find it and put it, the link in the bio and um, the description down below. But love this. So yeah, I was thinking of a white or black with these trousers. They're like a wide leg zebra. But I actually thought white. I mean, this is a bit off white now. It's a bit of a cream, but... I'll try this on in a bit, but I thought that could be a good outfit. And then that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's plenty. I'm not even going to bother with any more. I feel like we're getting somewhere now. I think the POA is going to be try these on, fold it all up. Then I think clear everything out that I don't want out of here. Um, put it all into a bag to go up the loft. And then I think we will pack all of this stuff up into the suitcase and then we can do like accessories jewelry because i need to i will do that like after because obviously i've got to go to primark to get those little bits so um i'll put the bits together that i've got but i feel like we need to do jewelry we need to do makeup we need to do like toiletries we need to decipher through what we want like i need to remember to take this because it was so good and um, perfume i need to remember one of these you know like the little things i feel like i need to do a quick list and also i am taking my brother's gopro how cool so we were talking the other day and i was like oh i wish that the camera was like waterproof i thought like how fun to get like in water footage for the vlog and then archie was like joe my gopro and i was like oh my god yeah and then i completely forgot and luckily he literally about an hour two hours ago he um voiced um timed me voice timed me facetimed me from his girlfriend he's like jody put the put it on charge and i was like oh my god i would have completely forgot so i've put the gopro on charge so guys we can literally get like footage of us jumping in and he's got the whole thing he's got like float for the gopro he's got headset for the gopro he's got chest like what do you call it a harness for the gopro he's got everything so we're going to be able to get some really cool footage so then i need to pack all my electronics need to decide what carry-on bag i'm taking thinking probably this for the carry-on um because it just fits everything and it's nice and structured too which i like and it'll sit on my suitcase this is from public desire i really should have got it to say like turkey but it says capri and um, so yeah i'll probably take that but we need to do like hair stuff makeup We've still got a long way to go but i feel like as long as the clothes are done i'm not going to feel as stressed so and anyway we are too blessed to be stresses so let's try these little eight evening outfits on see how they look see which vibe we like and then let's get the suitcase out okay these these are the trousers and this is how it looks on the top i actually really like it i feel like you could dress this up a bit more but i honestly just like the simplicity of it i feel like some nice white sandals gold jewelry maybe this bag i've got some really lovely sandals from primark which i'll show you in a bit but yeah i just feel like this is easy i feel like the trousers are really the moment and um, the only other option would be to do like I'm just trying to think if i this top maybe this is from princess polly i don't know whether this one would be cuter so let's lock this image in our head and then i'll try this one on this is the only other thing that i can really think of I haven't really, I haven't even got space for a mirror in here. So I literally use the viewfinder on my little makeup mirror. Um, I like this, I like the um, hem of this. What do we prefer? I feel like I prefer the other one purely because it's just like a smaller top. And I'm thinking, I do like this one too. What do you, what do you guys think? Oh no um i don't know i feel like either look cute either or but i think i'll go with the other one but i do love this top from princess polly and thinking about it i have a matching skirt for this top it's like a midi with like a big slit which i'm pretty sure is at ollie's mom's house so maybe these are little dog leads um maybe i'll have to pick that up just this is the problem i have so many clothes i don't even have the room for the one in here um but yeah i think i'll go with the other top to be honest okay so this is the zara skirt and obviously this just gives you 
an idea of how it looks with white. I think you, again, could wear this so many ways, but I just thought we could pop the orange. I do also have this in pink, but I can't for the life of me find it. Um, okay, so this is how it looks with orange. I just think it's more fun. I do think it would also look really nice with the pink, but is it fun to pull the orange out? Maybe I'll have a look if I can find the pink, but I do have this. Look, look I was hiding it then. I was pulling the skirt down. This is a bag from Miss C Empire, I think, which is orange, which could be nice i don't know if it's too orange whether i'd actually go black i don't know but it's an option what do we think it's kind of nice to be i feel like it's fun on holiday to be colorful let's just see if i can see the pink i mean it's so bright that surely i'd see it but it's not in here where is it is the question well i can see it okay right here's the pink hmm I feel like pink is actually gonna win, but I don't have a pink bag. I'd have to go black accessories if I was doing pink. Um, just ignore how you can see a bit of the orange, but I think pink actually is cuter. I feel like the orange on the skirt probably isn't enough to warrant wearing orange. Mm, I don't know. Kind of like the orange, especially with the tan. I think I've made the executive decision to go orange. I think it's more fun. I think that it's more fun. Okay, I'm procrastinating now. I'm literally just sat here like thinking what to do. So what I've done is I've laid out all my bags that I think I'm gonna take. I've laid out all my hats, all like my accessories. So like my um, headscarves, my sarongs, my caps, my bucket hats. And all my jewellery that I think that I want to take. Just some like funner jewellery that I wouldn't say is like my usual like. So I always wear the same jewellery every day. But just pick out some like other bits. And then I also need to pick out my shoes. But for now, um, this is what I've got. So we've got all my jewellery here. These are some bits from... I'll try and remember. Um, okay, these are from Coco Charms. She sent me a really gorgeous pearl necklace. And then also a little J. So I've kept these specifically for holidays. I thought they were gorgeous. This is just one that I got for my B for last year, but I never ended up wearing. This is from a brand I can't remember. This is just from the beach. I, I thought it would be nice to wear as an anklet. This is from Treat Studios. Frankie's here, by the way. Let me just move my bank card. Frankie's here. She's thinking, why are you packing? Where are you going? What's going on? <laughs> um, this is from Treat Studios. These little earrings here are from Anna Luisa. They're like Thunderbolt ones, but one of the clasps isn't working, so I'm going to get Ollie to have a look, see if I'll be able to fix it. Um, my nan got me that. These are Primark. These are Astrid and Mui. I can't find the other one, but I really love these, so I'm going to try and find it. This is from Rachel Zoe. It's a little pendant. Then I've got some other necklaces. Um, a belly chain. I think this was from PLT or ASOS. I think ASOS, actually. And then we've got Sarong, which is Boohoo. We've got three headscarves, which are from Boohoo. We've got a Uglo mirror, because I thought perfect to do my makeup with. Sheen, Sheen, the yellow one is Primark. Sunglasses, um, I think I'll take these ones because they're cute. These are my go-to. The rest of them, I, these ones definitely not. These ones I don't really like. Um, these ones I don't really like, but I feel like my mum might like these, so I'll keep them out. And then these are Primark, but they're a bit loose. Um, so I'm going to see if I can get another pair of these today. That's Ollie's hat. This is one from H&M. And then I think these are the bags I'm going to take. So this is Primark. This is Ego. Missy Empire. Unsure whether I'm going to take this or not, but I'm just going to get it out for now. This is Missy Empire too. I thought just if I wanted like a coloured bag. And then this is Boohoo. Uh, these are the hoops I was talking about for the green dress. They're lovely. They're like a squared off oversized, sorry, oversized hoop. So they can go in. Bracelet put my Coco Charms ones in and then any other jewellery bits that I get from Primark or H&M I will pop in so that's that we are slowly getting through it and um, I think I might start filling my case up so let's do that let's pull her in I'll show you which one I have okay so this is the suitcase I have I'll pull it up so you guys can see it's empty anyway it's so lovely. I got this from Janelle a few, sorry Frank, a few years ago now. I want to say three, definitely before COVID, I feel. So a good while ago. I feel like I maybe got it in 2019. And I just thought 
I am gonna like invest in a, in a good suitcase. I think it was like 65 pound. I've used it so much, my brother's used it so much. And he's done like long haul flights to Florida with it, with it, Mexico with it. So it's really done us well. Obviously the wheel's a little bit fucked, he said, but I just thought, I also have the matching little, which made me think, well, I'm not gonna run to get a new one until it actually breaks. Maybe I'll have to get a new one next year, but that's fine. So, what I'm gonna do is I'll put you guys down. Okay, so we will fill, why is there so much air? We will fill this part up first. Um, so I'm just gonna put these. Okay, that is that side done. So let's just zip her up. Do you wanna, go, do you wanna see how it looks? Here we go. Those are literally all my clothes. How good, and it's all in the one half. Okay, guys, we are walking to Primark. Thank God I'm out the house. I felt like I was draining and packing. Ollie hasn't even started yet, so that'll be a nice little activity to do later. Um, but POA in Primark, we want to return these two bikinis because I just think it's silly. Don't, not going to wear them, so I'm not going to keep them. We still have it on. Um, have a look at the jewellery, have a look at the sunglasses and then just have a quick look in H&M see if they've got any cute sunglasses because I saw some really lovely black ones the other day and I didn't get them and now I can't find my black ones so I feel like I should get them Primark guys let's see what they've got ooh I'm getting holiday vibes Holly takes the piss out of me that much I end up taking the piss out of myself I love this I don't really need another beach bag though, do I? It's so nice though. I feel like if they were like six pound, I'd consider it, but 10 pound. Mm. I also love this. Brodery shirt. It's 20 pound, look. It's got a little like patchwork on. I love it, it's gorge. I haven't been to this Primark for a hot min, so. Oh, it's giving nothing <laughs> it's giving autumn isn't it oh what a lovely trench coat though oh my god oh my god guys this is gorgeous 35 pound oh my god they have oh my god they have i have this black bag this is the white one it's lovely it's 10 pound and i love that cap too it looks a bit like my adenola one anyway we want a holiday so what else have we got sunglasses okay mm. i don't know if these black ones are a bit much Ready to be honest? I don't know what the side of them. So you, what do you mean? How fat the side is. Okay, what about the same. I just need a black pair of sunglasses. I saw some lovely ones in H&M. Sure. Um, another black pair. I'll have a look around the other side. I want these in black. This shape. These are two. Where? I don't know which ones are like though. Mm. I don't like too much of a cat eye. I like these ones. These aren't the ones I just tried on. Hold on. Yeah, I might know. No, no, the other ones were thicker. Look. They were these ones. Oh yeah. Different, these ones are better. Yeah? Yeah. Are you sure? What, like, I don't think, I'm writing you on glasses, there's a whole room in Primark buying glasses, they're not bad. Well, which ones do you think I'd prefer, which ones? Put the other ones on. I think I'm going to have to take a picture. I think I do prefer the other ones. What, these ones? Yeah, give you a bad um, tan on as well. Over. Getting full practical. Oh yeah, these ones for sure, for sure. The other ones are too big. The, the side's far too big, isn't it? Any other ones? These ones are cute, but they've got no tag on. I wonder where these have come ones. from. These ones? Oh, got the <laughs> prescription. Oh, there could be some ones. There could be some ones glasses over here with that tag on. Oh, God. Oh, God. Someone's had a shock of that. 
<laughs> Bless them, they've come to try glasses on and they've left their prescription. <laughs> I don't think Primark does prescription. Do we like these ones? They're nice, yeah. Probably the nicest ones you've put on. Really? Yeah. Okay, we'll get these ones too then. Who's gonna stop me? Your head would be too big for a hat. It's not nice. Really? Yeah. I think I should get it. Oh, if you need something to put a bit of shade over your eyes. I've got lots of hats. It's really nice though. I don't really have many neutral bikinis though, do I? Which I feel like I've got the more just to spread myself. Put the pink on too. How nice is that pink one? Oh, I've got my hair now. Okay, right, you need socks and I just want to look at the jewellery. I don't want to find it Oh. Do you, have you been to Nike? I've been to work. Really? I've got to try again tomorrow, not Jojo. Jojo. Oh, okay. Right. I'm getting these because I think they're cute. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I like these. These are fun, aren't they? These are fun too. Let's go for fun jewellery. Everything means everything. Means everything. What's this one? Is it? Uh, is it one that goes around your neck? It won't go around your neck, would it? Because you're too fat. Has it gone round? Oh it's, oh, it's making me feel funny. I don't like that. These are nice. This big three pack. But they're a bit thin for me, I feel like. They're nice though, aren't they? What a nice combo of these. These are four pounds fifty. I also feel like I... I just feel like I should treat myself to a new pair of pyjamas for the trip. My hair's stressing me out, I'm sick. I feel like I should treat myself to a new pair of... I just can't deal with my hair being down today. I do not have the strength. Mm. It's never going to go in like it was there. It's the annoying part. It's so rare that I managed to get my hair up in a clip. That's what I need. I need to look at the clips. Anyway, I'm going to treat myself. I've picked up so much jewellery. Let's just have a quick. I don't even know where Robbie is. Okay, I saw these ones which I thought were cute for holiday. I saw these ones. I literally have these, but I've lost like the backs of them all. Um, I thought this was a really cute necklace to layer with. I thought these were fun to bangle it off. And then I thought every day. Um, and then also these ones just for every day. But I thought these look really expensive. I feel like they're definitely do. What do you have in your hand? Just those, okay. Okay guys, progress has been made. Excuse the state of me, I thought I'd put my glasses on just to try that one fart, by the way, it's my fault. Um, just to cover the face, but we got a little Primark haul. So, first thing I've got were these packing cubes. Not a huge packing cube fan usually, because I usually use all of my like sheen bags. However, I just thought for my toiletry, I don't have like a big bag. I obviously have my Uglo makeup bag, but I don't have like a bigger bag. So these were a three pack and they were literally five pounds, which I thought was wild. So, I thought literally all my toiletries would fit, so let's look at the sizes. This was a very last minute. I just grabbed them literally at the till. So we have got one like this, which how nice is that to put all your toilet to? And they've actually got a little palm tree on, how cute. So we've got that. Then we have got one this big and then like a big one for size difference that big so i thought those would just be good to put i thought i can like differentiate between skincare hair care shower products and do it a bit like that and then other bits that i got so i got these pajamas because like i said i felt like i just didn't have like you have to get new pajamas when you go on holiday i'm sorry um i did get some really cute ones so i thought i'd pick these ones up these were £8 and I got them in an extra small. They're just like a yellow 
very dainty polka dot and i just thought these would be nice to get ready in you know the vibes okay now jewelry okay so i've got one of these i did have this in like the neutral color obviously i snapped it i did think that this originally was going to be like the savior how rough do i look i did think originally this would be the savior to my hair grip problem because it was really big but i still broke it so that was a bit annoying but i just thought i need a new one so i thought i'd pick a pink one up to be colorful then i got these sunglasses that you saw i got the cream ones these were £2.50 the grip was £2.52 and it is good if you haven't got like my hair's just obviously like i need like a specialist one i follow this one on um tiktok i can't think what the brand is but i feel like i should try that so these were £2.50 i feel like the glasses are actually making it look worse and then i got these black pair which also £2.50 so i love those and then i also just found these downstairs i think these are missy empire they're like a squared off tortoise shell so i will pack those two then jewelry i got these bangles these were literally a pound as one two three four five six seven eight nine ten bangles i just thought it'd be nice to like put on the wrist of an evening and then also these ones i thought were fun these were three pound fifty four six they're like a blue and a green bead i just thought these would be nice for like bikinis then i picked up this lip liner i thought this was foxy nude which is a really nice shade, but it's spice i don't even know what this is gonna look like i thought oh, i think i've picked the wrong one off there wasn't any testers and this looked like foxy nude but i had my hands full so much i can't even open it okay right i'll open that later then actual like gold jewelry so first pack i got were these ones you get one two three four five six in a pack and these were £4.50 and I thought that these were just a real nice like mix and match holiday hoop pack so these are them there's like seashells there's um little like pink diamonds and I also really just liked the plain hoop I thought the plain hoops would be nice in my seconds or I mean I can't change these yet because it's only been done for a week or two a week but I thought that it would look nice when I can change them. So I got that pack. Then I got this necklace. I don't know how this is going to look. It was literally £3.50. But it just gave me like something that I feel like Dion Crow would wear. You know, just like a nice statement piece of jewellery. I thought with like a dress or something. It might be quite nice. It's like thick. I just thought it was different. Sort of like a little snake. Then I also got this pack. I've had very similar to pack similar pack to this these were two pound fifty four three pairs i really like the middle pair and they're like quite dainty at the end which i really liked so got those then i got i was gonna say i'm sure i got another pair then i got this pair which were two pound fifty these have got like moons and stars i thought they were just a nice every day because the ones i've gotten at the minute are so um, they've gone completely silver and then these ones were £2.50 and I thought these were just so cool I feel like they're definitely a dupe of something I don't know what let's try them on and see how they look I thought these were just giving cool like I can imagine like chintzy or someone in these oh my god how nice let me sit in the mirror oh my gosh guys I love those they're like so like over size which i love oh i really like those remind me of little quavers so yeah out with the old in with the new hello turkey skies goodbye uk <laughs> okay so poa for the rest of the evening is just to get the last few bits at least just in the area honestly we're not going to the airport tomorrow till one i think so i've got literally the whole morning to pack the last few things i've got a lot of like work to do tonight just to get done before obviously we go away so i don't have to do so much when we're out there so i think i'm just going to pack these little bits of jewelry away and um, i showed you these ones in there all that because i had i returned those two bikinis so all that actually only cost me something like 12 pound which i thought wow that's amazing obviously i know it's not because you return but when you return stuff in exchange it feels a lot cheaper so we love that so i'm going to pack all those away then i need to decanter some of my products put my hair stuff in so i will just show you what i decide to take with me um, but i'm feeling excited now i feel more prepared than i thought i would be i thought i would be a lot more stressed but i feel like i'm fine i need to go through my makeup bag decide what bits i want to take i need to charge my devices but again i can do a lot of that in the morning 
and just like sort through my hair care, my skincare, see what I want to take. Put my other earring in. So yeah, well, the end is, you know, coming sort of near. And then we just need to sort what books we're taking, pack A and airport bag and all of that. Good morning, we're going on holiday today. Right, we are being picked up in approximately one hour and two minutes and I haven't packed my cabin bag, like my, I'm not actually taking my little cabin suitcase, but haven't packed my aeroplane bag. Look at the chair on my bed. This is honestly the state. Haven't fully finished packing my case. Can't find my other cherry flip flop, which is low key stressing me out, but I thought that I would just show you my case and then I can zip it up and send it downstairs to the fairies to wait and tell me how much I'm over. So I thought I'd just give you a show of what I ended up doing last night. So this is how we currently look. Honestly, living for the organization on this side, I think it looks so neat and tidy. So we have got my makeup, my curlers in here. This is just a beauty works one and I've only picked one. I haven't took all three of them. So then in this bag here, we have got a real mix of like skincare, hair bubbles, hair care, face wash, skincare, my razor, more like shower products and then a few like hair ties and hair grips. In this one I put all my shoes, I just need to find the cherry flip flop. So I went for my two Louis sliders from Ego, a pair of pink flip flops, my cherry flip flops and then I've also got these like pink marshmallow ones. In this one I got more like, so I think this is my um, makeup cleanser, my headband you know things like that i won't open them because they're all neatly put away but moisturizer deodorant etc in here i've actually got the gopro i don't know if i told you guys yesterday but my little brother has a gopro and we've got like really cool attachments so we're going to be able to get so much cool footage for the vlog so we've got like a floating like tripod so you can put it actually like on and it will float in the pool in the sea we've got like a tripod like like that you hold i also just brought a new tripod um from home bargains i don't think i'm going to take it i don't know but i needed a new one i was in there so i just picked it up then we got my book i want to get like a thriller too but i thought i'd take this book because i never ended up finishing it so i thought i might have a little flick through it's healing into the new high then i've just got ollie's hat which needs to go um i got my sporting rich cap and then over here, it all went a little bit chaotic. So I've got my bag, my beach bag, all my clothes are neatly folded up. We've got my disposable camera, some more bags, some hats. I put all my sunglasses and the Primark jewellery in this little Sol J Janeiro um, little like pouch. And I thought I'm going to take this to the pool and put up my sun cream in, um, hair ties, things like that. I thought it's a nice little like beach sized bag. So we've got all my bikinis, this has got the GoPro and this needs to go in my hand luggage so it's safe. But I can zip this up now, so that's good, now I've shown you. So, I will just pack this frolly, hopefully it doesn't get squashed. Same with this. Oh, and also I put my conditioner in these. These were so good guys, definitely pick them up if you see a pack. And for like £1.99, I feel like they really helped me. Um, I feel so unprepared. I just feel like I've brushed the whole day. Okay, so let's zip this up. The cherry flip flop, I just don't know. Let's have a quick look for that. I'll look for it in a minute. Okay, so that is done. What I'm gonna take as my hand luggage is this Public Desire bag, because it just fits everything in, and I like how structured it is. So what we need in here is, we need my tripod for my camera. Just lip products, I'll just slot those in there. 
Oh, I didn't pack my hairbrush. Okay, I'll type that in here with me. We are so unprepared. Okay, let's see. Oh, I didn't pack this bag either. <laughs> okay, I need to pack that. So my, my Laneige is going in. I've also got my hard drive, which is so like vulnerable. I don't know how best to travel with her. Like, honestly, I literally, it worries me. Okay, let's put that in there with the adapter. I don't know if to put it in like a sock and wrap it up. Is this extra? I just don't know. I don't want it to break because I'd, I don't think I'd get one over there and I wouldn't be able to edit my big fat vlogs. I don't know. Looks pretty good to me. Well, let's put her in the back. Um, my favourite sunglasses have obviously got to come with. So put those in. Rabbit. Don't get anywhere without him. He is going in. Also a pair of socks because I always get really cold on the plane. So a pair of socks is a necessity. Also a hair bubble which is on. I've got one on my wrist too. Um, my phone obviously i'll put this in the case in a sec i'll just put that on top um my blue light glasses then i've got my this is all like electronic stuff it's kind of boring but um i'll put my sd my spare sd card in here and take that so it's safe you just never know guys and um, also my sd card reader that can go in then obviously my camera, my battery charger, etc, etc. Okay, so that's pretty much everything that I'm going to put in my hand luggage other than like my laptop which is currently charging and my phone, my blue light glasses I always take. Um, that's pretty much it to be honest. Travelling quite light other than like I'll grab a bottle of water at the airport. So the, the cherry cider's winding me up so let me have a look for that and then I will come back. I got her. Okay, right. Let's go and put this stuff in my case. Holiday ready, friend. Three, two, one. Fucking hell, Joe. How much? 25. Oh, it's okay. I've got all the toiletries, so I'm just going all this. The way I've turned out, they're going to Oh, we can have that. Why, how much? It's a tie dye, didn't you? Five. That'll do then. Oh, no. Two. I was that's the wrong one. You need to lose three. Oh, you did. Okay, so, okay. That one's three. So, so even if he just says that one. Well, I'll give him both. Remember that one. Have you got loads of room? Yeah, because you've got nothing in this thing. Okay, I've gone with a hair up, just I feel like it's more practical. I think. Oh, I haven't had perfume! This is. <laughs> This is what I mean. I'm out of it. I don't know what to take. I don't want to take my Jacobs. It's quite a heavy bottle. I don't know whether to take. I've got some in here. Should I... Um, what this is supposed to be. This is an FM fragrance. Four one three. Oh, that smells nice. <laughs> Let's just make it as easy as that. Hey, got a bit of makeup on this, which I'm annoyed about, but this is one that I got off TikTok shop. I think I might just put it on with my Louis sliders. I'll get it out the bag. And then this bag, easy. Um, easy, casual, can get a cute airport pick. That's really all we're looking for here, isn't it, guys? Right, I've got a few more things that I need to put in once they're fully charged, but I'm just going to leave them until... They are, I've got my sunnies. We are literally holiday ready. I'll take you guys to the airport so you can come with us, see what we get up to. Um, but yeah, pretty much all packed now and I will see you guys at the airport. We're at the airport guys. <laughs> we've dropped our bags off, it's torrential raining. I know we've got to go to security. Do you want our back? So like just keep them all together. Airport mom mode activated. Okay, I am just going to grab some lunch. I'm starving. So busy guys. I honestly haven't been in the airport so busy for years. Obviously we never normally come in like non-turn time. But it's so busy everywhere. But I think I might get a jacket potato. I haven't had potato like that for weeks, so I think I might have that. Come to Soho. Hello, yeah, could I please get the um, vegan chili and guac? Yeah, 
please, on a jacket potato. Oh, down there. Okay, thank you. Vegan chili and guac. Well, where's the guac? So they put the guac on for me. Maybe they put the guac on. Do I get the guacamole from you? Yeah, yeah. That's everything, thank you. Oh, seven, eight, 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 eight. Card, please. Oh, I'll get the okay, thank you. Yeah. Guys, I got a chili with guacamole. I thought I picked up the jacket potato, but I didn't. Um, I don't know what the guacamole is like. Yeah, well, mm. it's actually really nice. It's actually so bizarre. How busy is it? Busy. The queue was so long, it was like an hour to get through. Oh. These guys are getting um, weather spoons. Ollie's having Burger King. And I thought I'd get something like this just to film it for the day. And then I think I might have a look around Duke Free. And then they've also, also got a Starbucks, you know, which is new. I don't think there's a pasta anymore. So then I think I might get a maybe a coffee to take on the way. I've also got to finish editing the podcast, so I'm about 10 minutes to go and then it's done, so not long. Is it recording? No, no. Yeah, it is, that's what that recording is. It's not, that's, that's just that it's on. What's your favourite part of holiday? Um, just being on holiday. Being with your family? Being on holiday. Getting burnt? No. Guys, we're just wandering around the airport because we've still got like 45 minutes so we're going to go to duty free. The chilli was so good and um, Mum and Andy are just sat having a side These two are restless so we're going to duty free. I wonder if they have like the, pra the Prada glasses. No. Oh, how bougie are these? These two old ones are nice guys. How nice are they? Oh, these are gorgeous. If they suit me. Oh, how nice. How nice are they? How much are they guys? Three hundred and forty pounds. How nice are these buses? And then they've also got just black. The black ones are so nice too.